The refuse workers in Ankara turn up at 7 a.m. every morning, whatever the weather. Guven Akin empties every garbage can, but he also checks each bin bag carefully, looking for books. He doesn't think that books belong in the trash. For years now, he and his colleagues have been bringing them back to the garbage depot in Shankaya. As a child, I would have loved to have books, but we lived in a poor district, and often there weren't any school books on sale. Not that we could have afforded them. Now he helps stock the refuse company's own library. The books first have to be cleansed, then sorted. The men have already rescued over 20,000 books from the incinerator. All of us can find books that we like here, and we can educate ourselves further. It's great. There's something for everyone in this library. Trashy novels and textbooks and much more. In the past 10 years, the number of bookworms has risen from 30 to 42 percent in Turkey. The library is part of a growing trend. I used to be a road sweeper. I also found books doing that. We used to give them to children or bring them home before the library was set up. There came a point when they simply had too many books. So someone came up with the idea of setting up a library in this warehouse, and the company agreed to help. Employees can gainfully use time during breaks or after their shift. Our library has now become very famous via social media. We've received many donations of books from all over the country. The next idea is to turn an old garbage truck into a mobile library for children. Guv and Akin and his colleagues are not only bookworms, but budding musicians too. They found their instruments doing their rounds. There's always such a nice hollow sound if you beat on the empty cans. We used to drum on them for fun. That's how this began. <laughs> So Ankara doesn't only boast a garbage library, but also a garbage orchestra, which is even planning to perform abroad. Society has to get used to the fact that we can also do this sort of thing. Refuse workers aren't only people who take away the trash. Ankara's refuse workers are showing the world that garbage can be recycled for the good of the whole community. <laughs>